welcome back all of you to the next session in the last video we have seen the different parts of plant and specially i dealt with the root part in this video we will see rest of the parts of the plant body okay so let's begin the second important part of the plant is the stem okay and stem grows above the soil because of which we can see the stem part now stem bears all the other parts of the plant such as flower fruits leaves branches buds everything is present on the stem now you all have seen different types of stems yes or no some of the plants they are having very weak stem such as climbers then some of the stems they are very thin such as rose plant and all and some of the plants they have very thick stem the thick part of the stem what is it known as it is known as the trunk okay i think so you all have seen banyan tree isn't it have you seen how thick the stem of the banyan tree is so that thick part of the stem is known as trunk okay now let's see the functions of stem the first function of stem is stem it holds the plant upright how by giving support to the entire plant body clear the second function of stem is it helps in the transportation of water and minerals to all the body parts if you remember in the first video we have seen that root helps in the absorption of water and mineral isn't it and that water and mineral is carried to all the other parts of the plant body by the stem clear then third function is stem helps in the transportation of food from leaves to all the other parts as we know leaves prepare food isn't it so who transport that food from leaves to all the other parts that is done by stem clear and some of the stem they store extra food in them you all love to eat potato isn't it so what is that potato potato is the stem part of the plant body so four main functions first it holds the plant upright by giving support second function it helps in transportation of water and minerals to all the other parts of the plant third it helps in the transportation of food from leaves to all the parts of the plant body and fourth it stores the extra food in them clear okay so the next part of the plant is leaf you all have seen leaf is it can you tell me what is the color of leaf yes correct leaf is green in color do you know why leaves are green in color because they contain a pigment in them and the name of that pigment is chlorophyll because of the presence of chlorophyll leaves are green in color and this chlorophyll pigment it plays a very vital role okay in the food preparation process clear now let us see first the structure of leaf the outer surface of the leaf okay this outer surface of the leaf it is known as leaf blade clear 
the tip of the leaf it is known as leaf apex the flat broad part of the leaf this part is known as leaf lamina the leaf is attached to the stem by stalk or it is also known as petiole okay so stalk or petiole is the part which attaches the leaf to the stem part a vein arises and which extends up to the apex of the leaf and this vein is known as main vein from the main vein fine hair like veins arises they are known as side vein okay on the lower surface of leaf very small tiny pores are present and they are known as stomata okay and stomata helps in the exchange of gases and water vapor with the surroundings clear now let's see the functions of leaf leaf they are known as the food factory of the plant body why because they prepare food for the entire plant body clear so the first function is leaves help in the preparation of food for the plant body second function is as tomato are present leaves helps in the exchange of gases and water vapor with the surrounding and the third function is some of the leaves they store their extra food in them okay you all love to eat cabbage lettuce and all isn't it so what are these these are the leaves of the plant body so three main functions of leaf first it helps in the preparation of food for the entire plant body second it helps in exchange of gases and water vapor with the surroundings and third it stores the extra food in them okay i hope so up to here it is very clear to all of you in the next video we will see rest of the parts of the plant body okay thank you